Hi there guys, I'm Miguel from Greedy Tech and in this video, I'll be unboxing and reviewing this Symphony's Duet IS Personal Pedestal Cooling Fan. I'll just gonna call it Duet A Cooler from now on. It's much simpler. Anyway, here's the product and as you can see, it has a completely brand new packaging. First time I got this product, I was like, I was really expecting an air cooler. Why did I get this cylindrical drum kind of a thing? But it does come with a brand new design and as you can see, a brand new packaging as well. So without any further delays, let's get on with the unboxing. Once we remove the box lid, there's a container in it. We have to open that to access the cooler. There's instructions on the top of the container how to open it. We have to open it from the bottom. Just turn the lid a bit and take it out. And now we can pull out the cooler. So guys, this is how the air cooler looks like. At least the main part or the top unit. I'll show you the stand later. So this is the whole packaging and you can compare it in terms of size, like how big it is. Now first, let's have a physical overview. On the top, there's a circular LED strip along with the handle, so you can carry it easily. On the front, it says Duet Symphony. That's the branding area. Following that is the touch control panel. Let me just remove the plastic film. I'll talk more about the functions in a minute. Underneath that, we have the fan outlet along with the adjustment lever. Underneath that, there's an ice and water tray. You can just pull it out and put ice or water inside. By the way, the tank capacity is 6 liters. Under the tray, we can also see this transparent cutout for the water level indication. Now, this is how the air cooler looks from the backside. You can also see the cooling pad and the vents on the backside. You can actually remove this part. I'll show you more about that later. Underneath that, there's the power cable. This is attached and you can plug it to the power socket. Near the cable, there's also some more information and there's also an outlet for water overflow, just in case if you add more than sufficient water. At the bottom, you can see the plug, which can be removed to drain the water. Now this is how it works. Now to power it up, just plug in the socket. Now you can touch the power button on the control panel to turn it on. Once you turn it on, you can see four more touch buttons. One is for the fan, followed by cooling, light and oscillate. For the fan button, you get three different speed modes. You can just touch on it to change between different modes. Next is the cooling button, which is used for water. If you want to turn on the water pump, then click on this button. Next, we have the touch button for the LED light at the top. Followed by a button for oscillate. Now, once you turn it on, the air cooler will turn 180 degrees to keep the entire room cool. By the way, these LED lights have very simple functionality. If they are always on, it means the functionality is on. If they are blinking, it means the functionality is off. And finally, you can also use this lever to adjust the wind direction to up or down. Now here's the tray. Now if you want to add some water, just pull out this tray, pour some water. You can also add ice to this tray. Just make sure to check out the water level to see if you need more. By the way, I would suggest you to use cool water instead of putting in ice, at least when it's completely empty. It actually gives you much better cooling. Anyway, if you already have water filled in, you can put in some ice. By the way, you don't have to use this air cooler with water. Like if you're using it in an AC room, you can just use this cooler as a blower. If you're not having an AC, then you can use the cooler with water and you get the cool breeze. Now to clean the cool pad or to replace it, this is how you can access it. Now you don't need an additional table to elevate this air cooler. You can just use the stand they provide. Now here's the container it comes in. It can be used like a stand. Just pull the legs out from the bottom part, place it on the floor. Now you can put the air cooler on the top for the additional elevation. So where can you use this cooler? Literally anywhere, anytime. You can use it while working at home, especially when you don't have an AC. And even if you have an AC, you can use it as an additional blower because it can help you maintain the temperature. Because if you use a fan, the temperature goes up very quickly. So in that case, the blower is definitely beneficial. And even if you have a sudden power cut, you can run the air cooler over an inverter, which is definitely a pretty good alternative. Besides that, you can use it anywhere. Because of its lightweight design, the handle at the top, you can move it anywhere you want very easily. Whether you're working in your living room or if you just want a bit of cool air in your kitchen, maybe you're cutting your vegetables, you can just place the air cooler wherever you want very easily. And you also have this oscillate feature which rotates the air cooler, which is a feature not available on other air coolers with similar designs. So that's definitely another good feature. 
So guys, overall, this is a pretty convenient, portable, large size cooler. I won't say it's mini, it's pretty big, I would say. Overall, it's a very practical cooler, I would say, or something that I personally really like. Like I can move it anywhere I want. Like at least I don't have to buy two or three coolers. I can just have one in the bedroom. I can keep it. If I'm in the hall, I can just move it around. It's super lightweight. Even with the water filled, it's not that heavy. Uh, so it's a fantastic product. So if you're looking for a slightly bigger cooler, I'm saying bigger because I've recently uploaded another video about the Duet Mini. So if you're looking for a slightly bigger cooler, you can definitely consider this product. By the way, this product is priced at 6,291. And I guess at this price, Symphony Duet Air Cooler is the only one which offers you portability, performance, and overall a great quality. So once again, I would definitely recommend this product for your home or even for your office or a shop maybe. So guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to our next video. Peace out.